What's going on guys, this is the Marathon Season and welcome back to the Skyrim Marathon. Um, last episode we we journeyed through the rest of the dungeon, cave, system, whatever. Uh, killed a bunch of demons and we ended up in this puzzle-like area. Um, I figured it out. I took about half an hour, a whole half an hour to figure this out. And the reason is because I wasn't looking at my other idols. Let me show you how, what I was thinking first. I was thinking first that there's butterflies here, so I know that there was butterflies. And I decided that that was a bear, and that was an owl. And then this one was ambiguous, so I decided that was probably just there to tease me or something. So I tried that, it didn't work. And then I thought maybe, maybe the bears are different because if you look at the hands there's nothing that really has like a bear like symbol whereas here you have butterflies and then on this one you have owls and feathers so I, I tried like all combinations of butterflies and owls so that did not work as well um, after a while you know I kept pondering I thought like you know maybe maybe it's the lighting Okay, light's hitting this one, it's hitting this one, and it's hitting that one, but it's not hitting this one, so I thought maybe Owl was actually a, a trick, and I think I decided that this was actually a bear, <laughs> somehow. So I tried different combinations, that didn't work, etc, etc. Eventually, I decided to check my inventory to see if I had any notes, which was probably something I should have done right away. I picked this up. And it says my fingers are trembling, the golden claws finally in my hands, and with it, the power of the ancient Nor Nordic heroes. That fool Lucan Valorans Valorous had no idea that his favorite store decoration was actually the key to the Black Bleak Falls Barrow. Now I just need to get to the Hall of Stories and unlock the door. The legend says there is a test that the Nords put in place to keep the unworthy away, but that when you have the golden claw, the solution is in the palm of your hands. Okay, so the solution is in the palm of your hands right well what I ended up thinking then was palm of your hands his palms are showing right no palms are showing and his palms are shown so I was convinced that it had to be the dragonfly and the owl <laughs> tried every possible combination no dice so I, I thought about it some more if you have the golden claw the solution is in the palm of your hands which means if you have the golden claw, you already have the solution. So I was like, huh, maybe it's on the golden claw. Derp a derp a derp. Guess what? It is. You go on the golden claw. If you look closely, I don't know how to zoom in on these items. Um, what do you press? Shift, Control, Alt, right click? Nope. Left click. Middle click? Scroll in. There we go. If you oh, if you look at this, you can see it clearly. Bear, butterfly, owl. Ha! Now I haven't opened the door yet, so I don't know what's beyond it. But I'm pretty sure this is gonna work now. Bear, butterfly, and owl. That was one long puzzle for me. Ah oh, man, I keep face bombing. I'm glad I didn't record. Uh, me trying to do this thinking. I would have wasted a whole episode trying to do this. Here we go. It's not my weapon. Alright. Oh, skills menu to level up. Let's level up, guys. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with health. I believe um, health is probably the way to go. Balance it out with health and stamina. And um, I'm going to save my perk. It says I can save it for later. I'm going to level up my archery and sneak a bit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What was that? A little bit of action. A little bit of puzzles. That's what I'm bringing you guys. One sec, guys. 
And we're back. Is that a person? No, right. Jeez. What's going on over here? I hope you guys don't mind that I explained my whole thought process. I didn't want to leave you guys out. It really did beat me up, that puzzle. Whoa, what's this? Weak Frenzy Potion. Yeah, Petty Soul Gem. Iron Helmet. Nah. Garnet, Gold. Sure. Targets have improved combat skills, health and stamina. I'll take it just for having it. Create creatures of people up to level 6 will attack anything nearby for this. Wow. Oh, I think this is the my first shout. Cool. Here we are. Word of power learned. Force. Unrelenting force. Find the secret of Bleak Falls Barrel. Bring the claw to Lugan. Well, let's. Um, we got a shout now. I want to try to. How do I do this? Um. No. Uh. Is it in items? No. These skills, right? No. How do I do this? Whoa, how'd you do that? How do I shout? Teach me, my friend. You must teach me how to shout. Magic? Shouts. Here we go. Um, unrelenting force. Dragon souls are required to unlock shouts. Okay. Oh, okay. Your voice is raw power. Recharge 15. Can I favorite this anyways? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ooh, 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 that's awesome. I'm guessing this guy has the ability to shout. Wow. Oops. This guy's making me waste my arrows. Don't do it. Ow. Gosh, I'm about to die. Man up here. He's almost dead. There you go. He's dead. Ooh, this guy must have some goodies. The dragon stone. Don't know what that does. Retrieve the dragon stone, deliver the dragon stone to Farangar. Some gold, iron arrows, an ancient Nord war axe of frost. Takes target takes ten points of frost damage to health and stamina. Wow. Uh an ingot and an iron shield. We don't need the iron shield, but let's go ahead and toss some stuff or overweight. Um weapons. Do we stop iron swords? We have a steel sword. Okay, how about apparel? We don't need as many boots and stuff. Uh, this is six. Shields are twelve. Okay, I want shield. There we go. 
Is that all I get? So... How do shouts work? If I, if I use my shout, I have to kill a dragon first, right? So, that means every dragon I kill, I get one shout or something. So, you gotta use your shouts wisely, I'm guessing. One sec. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, there's a chest down there I missed. Let's go get it. Saw it over here, right? Maybe not. Maybe it's on the other side. Oh yeah. Check me out, I'm shirtless. Is it back here? I want that chest. It's like a secret hidden chest. Oh here's one. Some gold and some healing. Nothing in there. Okay. I'm making just jump. Ah, I'm gonna do it. Ah. There we go. There we go. What do we got? Garnet, gold, silver ingot, silver necklace, and a petty soul gem. What are these soul gems for? Chanting items or something. Getting a lot of them. Or is it just money? Here we go. I heard you can enchant items. That's what I'm guessing. What is this? Activate handle. Sure. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, it's the exit. Awesome. we go some gold and another ingots gosh keep thinking something's behind me <laughs> paranoid a skull red mountain flower blue mountain flower. do I need these flowers I think it's a bad omen to take flowers from a grave all right To Skyrim. Dark Elf Blood. Dark Elf Blood grants 50% resistance to fire. They can use Ancestor Wrath. Ancestors Wrath to cloak themselves in fire for a short time. Nah, I'm a Nord. Resistance to cold damage. Baby. Okay, we finally completed that segment. Let's say we head back. Um home would be which way that way I don't even know anymore enchanter's potion is this platforming really okay Whoop. almost failed wow can't believe we can climb up all of this Look at that. I can climb up all of this. I'm gonna get stuck. Just know it. My name is Chimpo B. I own these parts. How do I... There we 
is Chimbo B. Staring across the distance. What's that? Alright, so, uh... I don't want to fast travel right away, because maybe there's something up here, you know? Maybe not. Okay. Let's just get down first. Down to the green area. We got... my house that way I'm hoping it is I need to sell some stuff like bad Wait, so can I chop trees now? Um, items? Weapons, maybe? War axe, not a, wa a war axe, I just need an axe. Um, miscellaneous? Hmm. Okay, we'll check it out later. I see a building over here. Are you friend or foe? I'm just a poor old woman, dear. No need to trouble yourself with me. It's tough just scraping by out here, but I make do. What do you got? You got a bunch of flowers. You have a bed. Read the song of alchemists? Nah. Well, maybe it's a level up. Oh, it is. <laughs> okay. The bed is owned. Let's get out of here. See you later, lady. What's that? Wolves are never friendly. To that lady wolf pelt hoping you can do something with this wow you're pro man these wolves took out this bandit here so a small notes I'll take that wait can I sell this I can no, I can't. It's too heavy. Alright, where's Riverwood? We should be... Oh, there it is. I think I see it. Home! Alright, guys. I'm gonna head back to Riverwood. How are you doing? No, you don't. Yeah, you wanna do the dance? Let's do the dance. Dun, 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 dun. What? What? Did you guys see that? Oh, there's a teleporting moose. Pretty awesome. I didn't know they have teleporting mooses in uh, Skyrim. So apparently, mooses can do some sort of little dance, and after they dance, they can teleport. Kind of convenient. Anyways guys, go ahead and click the top right to watch the next episode. This is the Marathon Season and thanks for watching guys.